time for a battery change. I just use a little swivel. Works pretty well. Let me turn the battery on. You can see the green light. It also has a voltage counter up front just for the time being. These are temporary. I'll replace them with something more substantial. I was mostly working on the spacing. And then the battery pack. Just press on the button. And the battery comes loose. I'm using three 3.7 3 volt LiPo batteries and each side of this is actually wired up in parallel so it's a 3S2C so uh, essentially one 3 cell pack makes a little over what, uh, 12, 12.1 volts the other side would make the same since these two are uh, in parallel together instead of getting a week 350 milliamps you then get a combined 700 milliamps from a three cell pack so um, I ran this about 40 minutes I ran this about 40 minutes and got uh, put 200 milliamps back in the 350 milliamp battery so I think I'm going to stretch it up to probably 50 minutes and uh, see what happens and of course we'll be able to double that time when I run these in uh, at the same time nice thing is with this setup is I only have to load up half the batteries at a time if I choose so while I'm charging the old set the fresh set can be running and when these are all charged up if I want to I can put them in there together and get double that pack size So switch is real easy. Bunch of holes going all the way up through those pieces so that you can see the light with a clear offset right there. And that just works as a little on-off pivot. And then my switch. Just stick here on the top. And this drops right into place and clicks right in. And then you hold the bottom and click that. And uh, fresh batteries. I may or may not come up with a better solution for this. It's worked the best so far for clearance going around corners. And really, that's, uh, that's all there is to it. So I can go ahead and uh, go ahead and get it running again. I also used some vinyl to uh, put some stickers on, continue the stripes, that's brick built, and the uh, cab is uh, stickers. It turned out really well. I did that uh, on both ends. And look, I forgot to put the wheels in, <laughs> and it still ran, it still pushed it. That's crazy great. Hold on one second. <laughs> 